This program has been rated PG-21. Parental guidance is advised. Welcome, welcome, welcome back. Na tunasema hii mwaka ni ya double double. Yeah, 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 yeah. My God is good, yo. We have them. <laughs> in the house, eh? Uh, we have the king and the queen. Uh, this place is getting heated. Mm -hmm. And we were at getting response. Uh -huh. Feedback. <laughs> well, we the, like we said before, we went for the break. Yes. Mm. Feedback is everything. Yes. Feedback is key. Mm -hmm. Anyone who want to have uh, to improve on their tour tour? Yes. 2020 and in the years to come, mm -hmm. you've got to do it a different way. Ah. Because there's no way you can have different results doing the same thing over and over. Doing again. the same thing over and over. Wow. True. Like this one thing that I would want to ask um, all married couples to try this year and in the years to come. Yes. Mm -hmm. People plan very well for quite a number of things. Mm -hmm. Yes. Maybe a business meeting, uh -huh. and they set time for that. Yes. yes. You know, mm -hmm. visiting school children, yeah. wow. they set time for that. Yes. Wonderful. Appointment for a doctor, you, you set, set time, time for and that. you honor that. Wow. I would want to ask all married couples, yes. 2020 and in the years to come, mm -hmm. why can't you plan for a family time? Uh -huh. mm -hmm. And when we talk about time. the family time, yeah. we are talking about a husband and a wife. Uh -huh. I'm not talking about together with your children. No. Okay. So every week, yes. you decide on a Wednesday mm -hmm. in the afternoon, yes. all the, fo the, the, the phones goes off. No SMS, no, no internet. No tweeting, no nothing. No nothing. And you decide that will become the feedback time wonderful uh -huh. the family time okay now if you don't do that it will not come automatically because yeah. you must plan whatever you want to have in your life True. for pastor so and myself mm -hmm. to be able to have healthy and good marriage mm. we have decided yes that once in a week yes you try to get us you cannot yes Hey. You try to invite us for a show, we will not, not go. Yes. Hey, my friend, you need to keep me posted so that I know. <laughs> so that I, 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 yes. I'm not the point where I'm telling you guys and you're not picking. Yes. <laughs> you know, yes. that is purely, you know, her time and my time. Wonderful. We share about ourselves. Ourselves. We don't talk about our boys. No. Uh -huh. We don't talk about, you know, uh, the, the ministry. Yes. Because again, you see, a pastor and a church is... You know, they, they are very close. Yes. Mm. And you, are, you can be carrying the church from January to December. True. Yes. From Monday to Sunday. Mm -hmm. So we keep the church aside. Yes. We keep children aside. Yes. And any other engagement, we keep it aside. Yes. So it is and the agenda and is su monene. Yes. Na kupereka na munagani. Uh -huh. Ni wapi ungetaka ni badrishe. Uh -huh. Ni wapi unasikia kwamba ungetaka tufike i, i, i mwaka. Mm. We begin to talk about ourselves mm. that is very important and that's what we're calling feedback time and what now that, that feedback time yes. also brings br brings us back to mm. communication yes how do you devise the ways as to how you communicate with each other wonderful right? yes uh -huh. conclude that point wow i wanted feedback. to say that uh yeah. that me time it's like you're lost in thoughts when yes. he's explaining no, yeah. things <laughs> <even> <laughs> You know, one of the things we agreed with Pastor, we are not going to be fake. Uh -huh. And we are not going to pretend. Yes. And we are not going to sugarcoat. Yes. Let us tell each other the truth so that we can improve each other. Yeah. And so when he talks about the, 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 the time, uh -huh. we are talking of me time. Uh, me time. Yeah. You must have that every week. Talk about how are you able to connect. Yeah. 
you know kissing kissing has really been ignored in families mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. watu wanasema bwanangu ananuka mdomo mke wangu ananuka mdomo yeah. we talk and about that yes, yes. and not even to the brush <laughs> we have other things that you can use and the smell goes oh, oh yes hey, yes I'm getting school yes yes, yes. yes. like bicarbonate soda is very good igata bicarbonate yeah. soda igata <laughs> very nice <laughs> that is the no unaweka to the paste na unaweka ana brush kabisa mpaka kwa hiyo bread inatoka yes. you get that hugging quality hugging like 10 minutes mpaka you feel the heartbeat of your husband yes. <laughs> we have an audience yes. in the studio yes. na tunataka yes. tuwapatie uh-huh. wakati pia uh-huh. so that we can also get to hear some questions yes. from them yes. na itakuwa vizuri sana yes. karibuni sana we are so happy that you guys are here yes. and uh, keep coming keep yes. coming amen yes uh, maybe we can shoot direct mm. to the questions yes Nashukuru kwa kuwa katika studio ya Rukap TV. Nashukuru kwa kuwa na wa hosts Munene Reverend na Susan. Yes. My name is David Kabuthi. I'm a pastor in Vivo Sanctuary of Glory and I'm married. I'm a mari- I'm married with two sons and two grandchildren. Wow. Wow. And thank God. Yes. My question is. Yes. yes. When we're in a marriage. Yes. Uh sometimes when it comes to tour tour. Yes. Husband we are denied our right. It is true. Akietu. Akietu. Yes. <laughs> when now you go back home the wife says I'm sick, I'm tired. I have a headache. And mm-hmm. there you are in need of that. Yes. Uh, and then they say no. Yes. What can we what can we do? Oh. As husbands. Good question. I echo I echo his sentiments. Yes. What can yes. we do? Oh my goodness. <laughs> <laughs> That's a very good question that has been asked mm-hmm. because most men are really suffering. Yes. In the sense that the wife is not sensitive mm-hmm. when the husband comes to actually know that the husband wants to atua. Uh-huh. And so I want to speak to every woman if you really love your marriage no matter how busy you have been you must remain some little energy because of your husband when he comes in the evening and so it is a deliberate and intentional you know thing that you do because we have all these home calls the children you know maybe you are in the shamba maybe you sure. had the cows yeah. but a wise woman back in your mind you must make sure that you are you have remained some energy some 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 strength for your husband because tua tua is not something you can postpone Yeah. So one of the things that I want to let every woman know be sensitive to your man. Da, does mm. it mean yes. we should be able not we. Yes. Okay, although we should also. Yes. But ladies yes. should be able to read the husbands. Yes. Because exactly. I know there are times mm. that he would come yes. and he wants nothing. He yes. just wants his time. Yes. Right? Yes. So do you do you think it's it's important for ladies to read their partners yes you can even tell him and that's what we are talking about feedback yeah. because if we have feedback i'm able to tell this man he wants his time uh-huh. and his time is to atua okay it can, no man would reject it to atua no man really? in fact after that hey. that's when he's able to relax uh-huh. and be able to actually you know articulate because there is something about to atua it actually you know makes you focus as a man it also removes clutter Yeah. you know and also the stress that a man has had the whole day in Aisha and is refreshed is this one of energized. The, this is one of the 44 benefits yes we will, <laughs> we will come to the benefits, to the benefits. And there is nothing long <laughs> yes we did yes. yes it's nothing long yes when pastor sue yes suggests to me yes as her husband yes, yes. that i want to atua yes that's very important and that's very important because yes i think ladies miss it yes when they they don't want to initiate that yes. conversation Thank you. Exactly. yes exactly and I, i don't know they think that how we are we are going maybe to perceive them <laughs> let us shoot to our next question yes uh, madam karibu sana majina naitwa jacinta wayuni yes i'm married for 24 years 24 Amen. years congratulations i have here five children yes. oh. and two grandsons amen okay. nafurahia kuolewa yes lakini swali langu nataka kuuliza eh mm-hmm. kama umeolewa na mume mm-hmm. mwenye anataka sana mm-hmm. na wewe ufikie hapo yes Uta, utafanyaje 
Haya mume wako anataka sana. A good question. Yes. And it's a very common question. I want to thank you ma'am for that yes. question. Yeah, yeah there are husbands who actually love sex so much. Mm -hmm. And I want to say this. God is a matchmaker. True. The reason why God would give me Pastor Munene who loves it to a so much. God knew I would measure up to his demand. Kwa hivyo Mungu anakupea uh, a task yes, that you are going to be equal. You are, <laughs> you, you, are, you are ready for. You are a task that you are ready for. Uh -huh. And so that's why the Bible says in the book of Genesis, I think verse 3, God was talking to the woman and he said, "You woman, your desire shall be for your husband." That is one of the scriptures that I, I believe in 100%. Yes. The desire of Tua Tua for Pastor Munene, I must understand it okay. so that I rise to that. Let because me, let be, because there is no pain in Tua Tua. Yes. So why should he come? He wants his things. And I'm saying I'm giving excuses. And there is no pain. And if there is any pain, then I'm supposed to see a doctor and to again, actually be no checked. Pain, no pain. No, no pain. pain. Let me ask the question. Mm -hmm. Assuming as she said, uh, mm -hmm. Maybe mm -hmm. uh, things were okay. Yes. Hapo mbeleni. Yes. Then uh, maybe you are undergoing some stress. Mm -hmm. Maybe yeah. things are changing. Yes. Right? Yes. yes. Then as a man, mm -hmm. uh, I'm still sad. Yes. But you're not. Yes. Then what happens? Because from uh, from where she uh, she speaks from, mm -hmm. I think she's asking on behalf of the guys when you're wamekua sawa mm -hmm. then for the woman and i feel maybe an ender chini yes but the guy is still on yes. or even vice versa the man might be going down but the woman is still sustaining wonderful mm -hmm. i want to say this that uh, one of the things that makes marriage work you've got to be intentional you just have to have this mindset yes. that listen to this that nobody has the responsibility to to, to, to a me Apart from Pastor Monene. This is something you cannot delegate. Yeah. Oh, we, yes. must, we must understand and clear our mind. Tuatua is not something you can delegate. You can delegate someone to drive your wife. You can, de you can delegate your wife to be taken somewhere by someone. But you can't delegate Tuatua. Mm -mm. So this is a, a, a thing that I must know. Mm -hmm. That if Pastor Monene wants to, to Tuatua the wife, my friend, I must, you know, program my mind immediately. And let him also prepare me, you know. As in Rukia Kama, do the border, border, yeah. you know. Think, uh, Preparation <laughs> is very important. Fair play True. is very important. Do you think, uh, mm. do, do you think, uh, I know you will concur with your wife 100%. Yes, yes. yes. Uh, but I want you to disagree just for a minute. Yes. <laughs> what will be your take on the same? Because uh, I'm assuming, take, yeah. My, my take is, is very simple. Mm -hmm. uh, Willie, um, in Tua Tua, your mind is very, very important. It's wow. the engine. True. The, the quality of your mind or the setup of your mind mm. will determine um, how your tour tour will be. Okay. Wow. Whether it's going to be quality yeah. or not. Mm -hmm. Actually, tour tour is an issue of your mindset. Wonderful. Very nice. Wonderful. Get That's it very powerful. from yes. me. Yes. Mm. Your mindset is very, very important. The number two it's important to maybe i was very good there before but now i'm not performing well mm -hmm. maybe like you said mm. it's important maybe to ask yourself what could have gone wrong with my partner mm -hmm. okay could or maybe, be, what, maybe what could have gone wrong with me exactly mm -hmm. yeah. exactly could there be maybe there's something that maybe probably maybe to to to, to sort out here mm -hmm. or, or discuss mm -hmm. here that's very very important mm -hmm. and therefore it's important for um, for couples to discuss. So I think it comes down to communication. Exactly. Very, very important. Yes. And that's why we are talking about it's important to be open. Yes. Wow. It's important to have good like premarital counseling. Because what happened is mm -hmm. when people marry and they don't have good premarital counseling, there are things that they skip or they hide one another. Uh -huh. mm -hmm. Those are the things you find them waiting you when you get into your family wow True. and True. most of the things that people don't speak openly mm -hmm. thinking that i'm going to hurt you or i'm going to run away from you i'm telling you the truth those are the giants you find in marriage and they begin now to draw you behind True. now 
when we counsel people, Pastor Sue and myself, mm -hmm. we encourage people to be open with one another. Yeah. Mm -hmm. You know, whereby you speak up you are, you, you, who you are. True. You don't quote, you don't try to, 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 to fake who you are. Because mm. it doesn't change anything. Exactly. So that me. if you are hating me, hate me before we get there. Hate me mm. now. Mm. No, yes. <laughs> wow. uh, we, if yeah, I have easy. a boy outside marriage, yeah. yes. I'll tell you now. Yes. Not when we are there. Uh -uh. Yes. If she had a child yes. or she had other relationship, yes. we encourage people to speak up. Yes. True. And you know what? I, we have seen people loving one another. We have seen people being real because of being open. Rather than you hide today, and then when you get there, you are getting my goodness. Why didn't you tell me yes. that this is who you were before? Yes. Very nice. At that point, we yes. have our third question. Thank you. Yes. Kwa majina na ito David Dongo Kamau. Yes. Na nimi wakoka Yesu Nibuana. Amen. Na washukuru kwa sababu ya kikithindi. Yes. Kwa sababu nyewe hii ni njia ya kukua doa mingi. Yes. Ambazo zinafunjika. Yes. Sasa swari langu ni hiri. Yes. Inafujia Yesu. Yes. Kwa sababu wanawake wamekua kitumia mbinu ya tuwa tuwa. Yes. Kama siju mtaita siraha. Aha. Wakati ya mekasirika, yes. sasa hiyo ndiyo wakati utatuangwa e. na ndiyo utapata. <laughs> Habda likuwa natake ya kitu furani, e. ama kuna jabu ambaro hamoku kukabariana na e. E. Sasa hiyo ndiyo wakati utakutana, ukihitaji, e. e. na otu watu yes. utawabia aji. Wow, a very good question. That, that's a very interesting question. <laughs> yes. And I know yes. iyo, iyo inakata across to almost 97%. Yes of men. Mm -hmm. The weapon yenye inawekwa ni hiyo. So that if you say yes, ah, then we are good. Mm. If you say no, eh eh. Tunabuta handbrake. <laughs> yes, <laughs> then we are back. Wow, thank you sir for the question. <laughs> That's a very good question and yes. I want to speak also to my women again mm. and tell them that never ever use tua tua as a weapon to punish or revenge what your husband has done. Because anytime you do that, you are actually breaking the scriptures. The Bible says in the book of 1 Corinthians 7 from verse 2 to around 6 that do not defraud one another for whatsoever, for whatsoever reason. Why? Anytime you defraud your husband, defraud ni kumunyima, wakati wawote unanyima mzee wako, the Bible tells us you are opening the door for the enemy to come and attack your man. And that's why we have a lot of sexual immorality sure. in the church. Yeah. Sexual immorality, you know, in marriages. Why? The wife was not, was not wise, you know, to know that this is not a weapon to actually use. Because why should you deny your husband just because, you know, you have a problem with your finances, with children, your mother-in-law? And that's what we are talking with you and we are telling yeah. women this way. Separate the matter from the person. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. That is so powerful. Ah. Separate the matter from, from the, the person. person. Mume kosania pesa. Hamuja kosania tu watua. Mm. Mume kosania school fees. Hamuja kosania tu watua. Tume kosania mother in law. Na father in law. Wacha kuleta yu maneno kwa tu watua. Because separating the matter from the person is very important. Mm -hmm. So that truth must enter in every in every being, in every bone, in every tendon. True. That I should not punish Pastor Monene just because his brother, you know, Alinitusi, something to rikosana na brother yake. Yeah. No, there's a difference that between Pastor Monene yeah. and the, the, the mother and the brother. So in the evening, ata kama tu rikosania juu ya mamake, baba yake, whatever, watoto, pesa, it is it is only women who have no who have no knowledge yeah. that is based on the word of God mm -hmm. that that use yeah, use to a tua as a weapon. Mm -hmm. According to God, that was not meant to be a weapon. Yeah. Any person who uses that, you are a, you are actually acting as a witch. You no. are actually yes, you are actually you know inviting the devil uh. using using that weapon you are talking about. Mm -hmm. And let me tell you the truth: the person who will suffer most it is you and your children. Wow. Yes. Let's go to our last and final question for this episode okay. so that uh, we move forward. Yes, please. Yes, my name is Maureen Longari. Yes, I'm Maureen. I'm so grateful for this program. Yes. As in, you do shy off for such things to say the facts. Yes. You mm -hmm. shy off. You don't have to say the reality. Now, straight to my question. Yeah. 
what do we do about the the marriages that that were to mm. the retriever revive re, is or the dead to what was as in ukoko marriage but it doesn't happen it just uh-huh. you're just there like it's dead yes and Thank before you. that wow. that what was, was very nice mm. awesome mm. wow right yeah. mm. okay if there is something that every married couple must practice it is to forgive and to actually forget because oh. one of the things that destroys marriage and that that connecting that mutual understanding is because pastor monene did something to me five years ago yeah. and i have never forgiven let me tell you the truth that's one of the greatest killer of tua tua uh-huh. in marriage because you know? it, it plays yes, up in your mind it keeps playing mm-hmm. in my mind even when we are tua touring it is still play, playing i'm bitter about what he said i'm bitter what he did and i feel like he will still go back again to what, what what he did to me five years so forgiveness is very important you know allowing bitterness to get out of your heart is very important how do you do that for example in, yes. in a very quick way you, you, how, you, how do i let out his bitterness number one if you've got to speak to each other very nice you see now communication is everything yes and yes. i want to say this communication and toa toa is important to you as blood is to your body a hundred percent with it this is very very important it amen is. one of the things that every married person must take mm-hmm. and must know yeah. yes the reason why and this is very very important the reason why you are born and god allowed you to be alive i mean so many babies who are dying that time true and you got married to that man to that woman it is to correct the errors of your mother and your father wow never forget that wow there are things that i grew seeing wow mm-hmm. either in my society yeah. in my community yeah. and all that and i know very well with it that those things i grew seeing and hearing mm-hmm. they are the ones probably that destroyed the marriages where oh. i was yeah. now we really, there is no way i can bring that now to my family yes. and i know very well mm-hmm. those are the things that destroyed true uh, to a tour yeah. they destroyed marriage and all that therefore as my wife pastor so has said mm-hmm. i must be deliberate intentional that there are things that i must correct if i am going to have a good family if i don't do that then whatever happened to those marriages will surely happen in my marriage today rasa i want to say something very important yes, can you let me say something up. yeah as we wind up yes. something very important my wife pastor sue yes she is the woman i will spend all my lifetime with praise the lord amen. i receive that there is no other woman amen therefore i must put it in my heart yes. and in my mind mm. this is the woman amen. i will to a tour with yes this is the woman mm. i'll spend my life with amen so i'll be very intentional come on mm. we combine we correct today yes so we solve it now amen because there's no other marriage mm-hmm. i am going to have mm. so come to a toy konashida mm. what do i need to do to correct that wow good Come mm-hmm. at what we call What does he? What does she? What do I need to do to correct it? My friend, we are going to end there for today. Wow. And until next week, same place, same time. Mm. This has been Look Up Family Time. I've been your host Ingene, or in French you can call me Gene Oyi Devi. Cheers until next time. <laughs> Thank you very much. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you so much.